Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood episode 33. So we're heading north this episode. It'll be good to see a new location, I think, because we've kind of been in central most of the time. I mean, it was exciting when we were in different places like Xerxes and Shing and all of that, but it was very short lived. Yeah, exactly. I'm excited to explore this new area as well and meet some new characters. I know we've got a Miss Armstrong waiting for us. Yeah, I'm pretty excited too. Uh, we we both really like Armstrong. Yeah, so, um, to know that there's more out there is quite exciting. Yeah, it is. Um, so I'm assuming we'll get that this episode. And then there's also like a cat and mouse chase sort of thing. Um, yes, Scar. Yeah, Scar and Kimberly at the moment. So it looks like Kimberly has Scar figured out. Uh, whether or not they're going to see each other this episode, I'm not entirely sure. But Scar is also with Dr. Marco and they're going to try and decipher some of uh, Scar's brother's notes. And then hopefully after that, Ed and Al are going to come just in time to figure out what's going on uh, with the help of Scar and Dr. Marco there. Um, yeah, and May. Yeah, but it's likely not going to be that simple. Uh, Kimberly's probably going to intercept the operation and then there's going to be a big fight. So... Yeah, he's ready to go as well. It's been a long time for him. But also, if you guys are interested in getting early access to these episodes, I'll leave a link to our Patreon down below. Also, if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. That's the first bit of useful information from one of these soldiers. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, Kimberly may have been doing this all, of, you know, all by himself. It would have been just as successful. There are several other places further on where rock slides have closed the road. Ah. Yeah. Convenient. And it would be equally simple for him to destroy the face of a mountain to once again block. Ah. Mm. Uh -huh. Send the soldiers north. He's good. Mm. The northern wall of Briggs. Yeah, but it's given himself away. No, that's what I, I meant. Kimberly's good. All oh, right. Yeah. That's yeah, kind of annoying, but he's that smart. You ever been to the snow? No. Cool. Have you? Yeah, I went to a fake snow excursion. So you haven't been to you know, the snow? Oh, no, I have, actually, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Why do you ask? I was just curious. Oh, yeah, I remember. We had a snowball fight. Aww. And we made a snowman. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Shit, okay. Skulls and shit on it. <laughs> <laughs> a bit dark. There was a man fitting Scar's description seen at the station one stop ahead, sir. Are you sure about that? Shit, soldier? they're close. Yeah, they caught up really fast. This job is mine and mine alone. I don't want you people getting in my head, <laughs> understand me. He's just itching for a fight. He wants to use that bloody stone. Yep. Why are they not showing Marco's face? Well, they said he was with a middle-aged man with black hair. Didn't Marco have grey hair? I'm pretty sure it was black. Oh dear. Shit. Deary me. You can't jump off when it's going that fast. He will die. Physics don't make sense there, but 
my question it too much. It's anime. Don't exactly, worry about the physics. Exactly. Doctor Marco, I'm here to apprehend. I think yeah. I think Can't our hunch is correct. It's not him. Surely you're not alone. Where's your friend Scar? Yeah, it's not. It's that dude. Yeah. What's his name? Sorry, but you're not going anywhere. You're mine now. <laughs> Hit him oh, with the attacker shit. surprise. The murderous has fallen. I've heard so much about this. Excuse so me. Gonna lose his shit. How hypocritical. Yoki. That's his name. The other dude. Yeah, it's good memory. <laughs> all the names are like really easy to remember them. <laughs> They're all like four letters. <laughs> That's true. Oh dear. Oh shit. Yeah. Man is pissed. This is a long oh. time coming. Get out of there, Yogi. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. I think Scar's outpowered here. I think the opposite. Kimberly's been in a prison cell. Oh, the stone though. Yep. No, but he needs a stone for other things. I remember Does he another not? fellow who looked just like you, except he had glasses. Of course oh, it's oh, he's rubbing salt in the wound, a piece of crap. Hey, uh... Yeah. I just got out of prison and I'm still rusty. See? I wrote the episode, Carly. That's what I said, no? For goodness sakes. <laughs> Physically, I'm at a disadvantage. Lost his heart. No, but I think you're right. <gasps> oh, yes! Shit. No, the regeneration, right? Power of the Philosopher's Stone. No, but it's different. He just uses it. It's not part of him. Oh, dear. Ah. Oh. Until we meet again. Pretty messed up philosophies. Yeah, he loves the adrenaline. Men probably love skydiving, all that sort of shit. Nice. Yeah, bungee jumping. The giant swing. Yeah. You ever done that. the giant swing? I did. Pretty sure I stained my pants after that. <laughs> I didn't really oh, mess his face up too bad. I wish it could have healed your face completely. Oh, oh okay. This little girl does like no complaining whatsoever. Yeah. Full metal alchemist. Full metal alchemist. Full metal alchemist. <gasps> Wait, I Take it back, it. take it back. Oh. Olivier. Oh. Oli Olivier Mira Armstrong. She's pretty. Mm. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Full metal alchemist. Full metal alchemist. I believe they said they were going north. Oh, all right. Oh, she's Can't checking up on the boys. Uh, like usual. Hmm. <laughs> oh dear. You know what that means. They're gonna die. No. Oh my gosh. Garfield has been an asshole. <laughs> uh, he wanted to go into the cold. He was thinking it's got to be better than the desert or whatever. She couldn't have lived in this for an entire month. Sure she could. She would have killed a bear. The bears around here are more than 15 feet tall. <laughs> Holy I, crap. I wouldn't put it past Izumi. <laughs> I thought it was a bear. It's a bear. No, it's Armstrong. Is it Armstrong? Did he come along? 
Oh no, it's just dude. Got his name. Oh no. <laughs> Buccaneer? Oh, he looks similar to one of the guys we saw in the Ishval and um, uh, flashback. Oh, he's gonna snap it off. Oh, Winry's gonna be pissed. Doesn't work here. Is that supposed to hurt? What's going on? Why did my For shit's sake. Does his work? Oh, oh his head. <laughs> oh, what? Just splendid. Was that always there? Who are they? Yeah. I'm sorry. Lovely I lips. See you there, General Armstrong. I apologize for the disturbance. <laughs> there she is. Who's that dude? It doesn't matter. <laughs> Major Armstrong's older sister. Older sister. Wow. What? Do they? <laughs> oh my gosh. Sure. But how do I verify that? Anyone can claim to be somebody famous. They're very untrusting here. He's hollow. They have to be. They have to protect these yeah. uh, borders. Just read that. <laughs> my sister. Got a flower. She's like, yeah, this is definitely from him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No. Oh, okay, that's enough for her. This is incredible. That wall is really, really, really tall. Quit gaping like an idiot and start walking. Hey, she's Before very I different to her brother. Limb from limb. I love her. She's got. <laughs> Philip, do it. <laughs> Be warned. I will coddle you because you're children. I think this man is Ishval, and that's why he's covering his eyes. Anyway. Brakes. Here, only the strong survive. I'd work my ass off for her. She does have older sibling uh, energy, though, I will say. Mm. There it is. Oh, they found it. The notes. Or some of them. That's it. Scar's brother's research notes. Wow. Go. Will the information in this book bring us hope? Or do its pages contain nothing but despair? Mm. Notebooks aren't usually filled with... Uh, Pretty things in this show. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, so Olivia. Yeah, I got another waifu. I mean, that's just great. <laughs> that's just great news. Oh, for goodness sakes. That seemed to be like a major character reveal too. So yeah. I'm assuming we're going to see a lot of her, which is great. Let's talk about the end credit just because it's very fresh. Yep. So he studied... Xingyian, was it Xingyian? Xingyi's alkahestry. Xingyi's alkahestry mixed with Hemestrian alchemy. I'm led to believe that each different type of alchemy derives from a specific source, right? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking the Hemestrian source for alchemy is the father. Okay. I'm thinking he's the source. He can turn off the... Right. A mistress alchemy. I'm just, I'm just spitting out theories right now, but this makes sense about what Envy was saying when Al and Ed and Gluttony went to go visit the father. Yeah, it's like you don't even know where you get your power from. Yeah. So I'm thinking the father has that specific alchemy or whatever, but Scars is not derived from a mistress alchemy or the source for a mistress alchemy. Yeah, it's got to do with the Xingyi's alchemy history. Well, he's not from Xing. But, like, but it's it's he can still probably harness the power. His brother probably okay because that's out. where he was. Yeah, okay, that's what he was studying. Interesting. Yeah, that's where I'm leaning towards now at the moment. Um, okay. Ed couldn't even use the alchemy there where they were. Yeah. That's why I'm thinking it. It all just comes from different places or whatever. I don't know. 
I'm not entirely sure. Um, that is still a big mystery, isn't it? Yeah. I liked Scar using Yoki there as um as a diversion or yeah. like a that was quite clever. A little minion there, uh, and sent Marco and May to go find the notes because yeah, he must have suspected that someone was on their tail. Yeah. Yeah, very smart on his part. He's using his brain, which I like to see. Yeah, well, Marco's very important to this operation. May kind of fixed his face, which is nice of her. Yeah. She couldn't fully fix it, but... Yeah, there was that, and I think next episode, uh, we're probably going to learn, finally, about these notes and why the alchemy doesn't work in certain locations for certain people. Yeah, I'm scared to sort of learn what's written in the notes, though, because... Yeah, notebooks kind of give me a bit of PTSD now from this show. Well, I'm actually thinking that what we were theorizing about might be off because how come Scar can use it in different locations? That's the question there. Because he gets his power from a different source, like you were saying. Yeah, I know that, but can someone turn off his alchemy? Possibly. Okay, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <gasps> Isn't there something to do with, like, some figure... Yeah, some person that went missing from Shing or something. Do you remember something oh, about that? Oh, one of those. Oh, yeah, that story or yeah. whatever. Yeah. I wonder if it's got to do with that. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe he's the source. Mm. Okay. I think we'll learn a little bit more about Olivia yeah, next episode too. Is this wishful thinking or no, well, are you I'm being practical right now? She just got introduced, so we've got to learn more about her, which is fantastic. Um, She's got some Izumi energy as well. She's like... She'll be mean to you if she has to, but I reckon she's very warm. Okay. Yeah. Even though she's in the snow. I think I that's, see. I think that's I the see. whole point. Um, I see on the outside. Yeah. Warm on the inside. That's right. Izumi has the alpha energy, right? Olivier has the alpha energy too. And that whoop your ass if you fall out of line. Oh, yeah. I like that. But yeah, you kind of like that, don't you? Yeah. Just the other day we were watching something with like, you know, a woman like Olivier and... uh Izumi and Angela was like, I would work so hard for her. <laughs> Carly, don't expose me, man. <laughs> I've exposed you myself. You expose yourself. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, Kimberly got messed up there and, yeah. and lost that fight. Um, had to retreat, which I like to see. Yeah, my hunch was correct. He hadn't fought in a long time because he's been in prison. But then I started to second guess myself because you reminded me that he's got the Philosopher's Stone. He just used it to cut off the, the train, yep. the carriage, right? Um, but he doesn't want to exhaust its power because he needs it for something bigger, right? Mm, so It's true. Yeah, he's got to retreat. I'm sure that fight will get revisited at some point. Yeah, but now he knows, I guess, how strong Scar is. So next time he'll go in knowing that at least, mm-hmm. which kind of sucks. But what can you do? I just really hate to see the bad side infiltrate the military like this just the whole thing pretty much has just gone to shit it has but i'm pretty sure there are still some um some good guys out there like olivier 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 right so um (laughs) i I actually wanted to comment on the auto mail but i'm thinking there's a big like plot reveal or there's a bit of information that we're missing here that's very important to the story and that is the source of Power, like where the power of certain things come from. Mm-hmm. Why is the auto mail different as well? So he, it, like Ed's auto mail is just shit, and it not shit. I'm not bagging Winry. Sorry, that's my bad. I'm saying it doesn't, like it hurts him. It's a hindrance to him in this environment. Yeah, I think because it's so like freezing cold. Yeah, but the other dude, what was his name? Captain Buccaneer or Buccaneer? I think it's Buccaneer. Had um, worked a lot better yeah he probably had someone else design it someone who knows what can withstand what the metals conditions to use yeah in those conditions okay. um i want to theorize a little bit more about the end what marco found there so it's the fusion of the amestris alchemy and the shingi's alka history okay the fusion fusion i think that's the key word there the fusion so partially using the power that's provided from the father and partially getting your power from somewhere else, that combination? I'm not entirely sure, but remember how, like, they were saying that with scars, you'll remember this better than me because I'm pretty sure you mentioned it in a discussion. 
how his alchemy, when it happens, works a lot different. There's a step that he does differently, or there's a step... Oh, yeah, he doesn't use, like, reconstruction. Yeah. Yeah. There's deconstruction, reconstruction, and then... Construction. Construction? Deconstruction? Yeah, he doesn't use the last step. Okay. And that's probably got something to do with the fusion between the alchemy. Yeah. Because Scar's power comes straight from his brother. Yep. So the notes will essentially just explain Scar's um, version of alchemy or alka history or whatever. Mm -hmm. I do think that the guy next to Olivier was Ishvalan. Okay. I wonder if he's going to meet with Scar. Maybe they'll have some history. Who knows? But it's like gone from one extreme to the other. He was, you know, in the desert. And now he's in the cold. You make a good point. So maybe he links into these theories somehow. And that's why they needed him. Because they needed his type. Maybe, does he know alchemy? That guy? I don't know. Alka history? I don't know either. Probably. uh, I would say probably not. Because his brother gave it to Scar. And that was it pretty much. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah. Uh, why was I didn't take note. Of him. Was his eyes covered? You didn't see him? No, I didn't see him. So, yeah, there was a guy standing next to her. Why would I be looking there? You'd be paying attention. Observing. I was observing. Yeah, well. Yeah, the glasses were a giveaway. Okay. Yeah. Covering the red eyes. Yeah, I think so. Okay, you could be onto something there. I think so. Um, I'm pretty sure I saw the name of the next episode. The Ice Queen or something like that, so. Ice Queen? Olivier. Or Olivier, sorry. Olivier, I gotta get her name right. Mira Armstrong. Olivier Mira. Mira. Armstrong. Okay. Uh she's gonna be getting an episode dedicated to her. So um I'm excited for that. Uh, yeah, I want a bit of a backstory. I want a flashback of her and Armstrong as kids. It's funny how she knew that it was him straight away, just <laughs> the rose and the, the writing stamp and everything. He seems very different to her though. Yeah, but we don't really know her yet. No, we don't. Go here, Angelo. Yeah. There's something special about her. Yeah. She's got this femininity about her that's like quite described. She's got that, you know. But she's powerful too. Those lips going on with the, the pink and the glossy and then the hair. So you like her more than me already. So you can't be. I'm just saying. Okay. Well, yeah, I'm excited for next episode anyway. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.